Matt is a gentleman's photographer. He's very easy to work with, he's very polite, he's cordial, and he produces a great product. And just the space is great, he's great, Matt's great. Putting on costumes and hair and makeup just makes magic happen and things come together and I think that is always the most fun part is just seeing that come to life. Uh, I love working with Matt. I love uh, playing in his wonderful space here. Uh, he always makes it very welcoming and it's always super fun and fast and efficient when he gets to do this. So I really love working with uh, Matt McKee Photography. I started working with the Footlight Club about 15 years ago, and I have uh, been making posters for them ever since, so I think we're somewhere around number 60. I think a lot of the thinking through what we want the poster to look like ahead of time, our costume designer spent quite a bit of time pulling some pieces, uh, just getting the right look together, so quite a bit of preparation on that. What's really interesting about doing these photo shoots is it's so far before the show, so often we don't uh, have the exact costumes that are going to be in the show yet, or if we do, they're not quite finished, or maybe a piece or so is missing. So when the photo shoot comes, sometimes it's a fun adventure getting the costumes onto the people and making sure that they fit because it's so early in the process, but that's what also makes it exciting as well. The concept is everything, so I try to find out as much as I can about the production first, and then I also talk with the director and the producer to try to find out what their ideas are for the show to make it uniquely theirs. We try to come up with a concept that would be appealing to an audience that embodies what the play is about, and then we kind of riff off it from there and throw ideas around the table and, and come up with something. Matt and the producers and I had a meeting along with the stage manager and just sort of thought through what we wanted the poster to look like. So once here, uh, everybody else kind of takes over. I have a few philosophies about what it takes to actually create a successful photo, whether it's a photo for uh, the posters or for my commercial clients. It starts with what our main idea is the core concept of the story we're trying to tell with that one image and then everything else feeds into that so costume attitude of the person background but it starts really with with an idea and the poster is basically done already in my head and all we're doing at this point is just coloring in the line matt was super professional um he clearly knows how to work with actors he uses words and directions that actors understand and he gives very clear direction, turn this way, pop this foot, look up. It's just kind of weird um, to be in character for a still shot. You know, you'll have Matt and then you'll have the director of the play sitting next to him and they'll just kind of coach you through, pretend you've just done this or pretend this just happened and they give you poses and Matt's very trained and knowing exactly clearly how to convey to someone what I want them to do. You have to speak their language in like the two minutes you're interacting with them. And that, that can be tough, but Matt's great at it. I think Matt does a really nice job of capturing emotion and he works really well with the costume and the directors and the actors, but he also brings his own ideas to the table, so it's a really nice collaboration. My favorite part of the shoot actually has to be actually working with the actors. It's always fascinating to me to see these people put on these roles and you start talking to them about who they are, who their characters are, and they start embodying it and they start projecting it out and, and the fun part is to capture that. Matt has a really good way of knowing, you know, as a photographer for you, the subject, to calm you down and to get you focused and he always manages to get great shots. I started out doing photography to, to create worlds, to create stories that are not necessarily actual truth, but you feel like you've seen it before, maybe in a new light. My mission is to tell a story for a client to help them to sell their business, their services, their facility.